and drive away. And I don't have to unplug the car in the snow, and mm -hmm. I don't have to get cold, and I don't have to put the dirty wet cable away. What we've got here is a 7.4 kilowatt system installed in the Nissan LEAF. Um, it's integrated into the high voltage network of the car, including the charging system. And we use a cell phone here to give the information about the charging system and alignment to the driver. So on a proper, fully integrated system, that would obviously end up in the, in the car's display. So just imagine you've gone shopping, you're now coming home. When you get about 30 or 40 meters away from the base pad, you get communication from the car to the power supply. And so what that allows to happen is that the system goes into alignment mode. Aligning. That could be automatic or for the demo car, we just control it manually. And then what you do, just aim for the base pad and then keep driving. I can't see anything until the system tells you to stop. Aligned. Easy. Turn the car off, get out and walk away. But if I go a little bit further, we hit the maximum range and I'll go backwards, hopefully slowly. So there's the Aligned. start of our tolerance zone and we can keep on going backwards end of the zone. So what you see there is you've got the sort of 15 centimeter by one uh, 20 centimeter tolerance zone or rectangle mm -hmm. and you can park the car anywhere in that area and you'll get the full power charging and the maximum efficiency plus or minus one percent. So if I just go forward again and we can stop there. We can put the handbrake on, we can turn the car off and if the car wants to charge uh, it will now start the charging automatically. Charging. And this should go up to maximum of 6.6 .6 kilowatts of power into the battery, but I think it'll stop about 6, 6.1, 6.2, just because the battery is really cold because we haven't done a full drive. And that's it get out, walk away. If a, a Coke can or a drink can blows under the car, the FOD system you saw inside will detect it. If someone goes under the car, the system will detect them, shut down, and yeah, you don't have to go out on the snow.